Good morning from Bali. I am revamping my whole wardrobe today. Well, my whole backpack. <laughs> I'm sick of wearing the same outfit. So I'm going to a mall in Bali and I'm going to revamp my whole wardrobe, send all of the old stuff home somehow. And yeah, can't wait to have some style. I'm just having some breakfast in the hotel now. I've ordered a coconut for my drink. Put the back on there. Let's try it. Big straw. It's nice, but that straw is way too big. This is my breakfast. <laughs> I've got spaghetti bolognese. Do you know, I actually really don't like breakfast food, like eggs, bacon, toast. It's just not a bit of me. I'd much rather have like a lunchy meal for breakfast. So, spaghetti bolognese it is. This will keep me fuller for longer as well. Unreal. Right, I've just got to the mall now. This is it, it's right on the beach here. I can see Zara already, so I'm excited. Let's go in there. Right, I'm in Zara now. The stuff is so cute already, have a look at it little outfit the shirt and denim skirt I love that shirt this one with the jeans this is the Zara how cute is this little score with the matching top love that I'm getting that this little pink jumper I absolutely love that if it weren't so hot here I'd definitely get that they got such cute stuff. I'm gonna get some of these little tops as well. The lighting in here is terrible, but I picked up these little shorts. I don't know what I'm thinking about them. They remind me of like pajamas a little bit, but they're cute, but I just don't really like the fit. And then I've got these other bits as well that I'm gonna try on now. The lighting in here is absolutely terrible. I don't know what's going on, but I've got this little orange top. Don't really like it at all and this skirt that I do not like either. So shopping is going well. I don't know why I look so orange. <laughs> right, I've just walked out of Zara empty handed because I absolutely hated everything I tried on. I don't know if it was the lighting in the changing rooms but it was not given. How cute is this mall though? It's like outside, inside. So cute here. I feel like I'm in LA or something at this mall. I'm going in Pearl, Pearl Lambert, see what we can find. Hello! I've just come out of Pearl Lambert, and that was successful. Um, and now I'm in Stradivarius, and I'm about to try on this skirt. It's the only thing I saw that I liked really. I saw it in the window and it looked really good, so it's really loud in it. I love this skirt so much, but I don't know if it's practical for travelling because I've got to sit on the back of motorbikes and stuff and this is not able to do that. So I don't know if I should buy it or not, but I do love it. But is it practical? No. Oh, I am in... What shop am I in? I'm in H&M <laughs> and... I've got these shorts, but I think they're just too, like, baggy for me. Well, they'd probably be really comfortable, but... I've also got these as well, feeling the colour in H&M, but... It's stressing me out. I don't know how people, like, video while they're shopping, because I'm getting flustered. I can't really find any, like, nice things. I'm actually really struggling. But I can find loads of nice stuff, but things that I can take travelling with me is a different story. Alright, I'm back in Pull and Bear. I'm not joking you, I've never struggled so much to find clothes that I like in my life. Um, the bags are building up, so this is filling up too. I'm going to try on some more stuff here. I've stopped for some lunch in a little Italian because the shopping is stressing me out. I don't know how people like vlog while they're shopping because I can't, I can't multitask. But I've just come to this little Italian, it's really cute, it's like 
all lemons on the tables. That's what that's what drew me in. Um, I've ordered a steak and chips, and it's too hot to shop as well. Like it's like outside, and then just the shops are inside. So when you go in the shops, it's cool, and when you come back outside, it's boiling hot and absolutely sweating. And I get hot and like flustered shopping as it is. So trying to video and shop in the heat is not is not a good combo. But I've got all my shopping down here. So I'll do you a massive haul when I get home. Oh, we've got a bread basket. A balsamic and olive oil. <laughs> I've eaten it too quickly though. Does anyone else just fill themselves up on bread before they even have their dinner? And then when they dinner comes, they don't want it because they've eaten too much bread. That's me every time. If there's bread on the menu, bread and balsamic, I'm getting it. And an ice cold bottle of water. See, I'm really struggling shopping because I like so much of the stuff and then I realise that it's not practical for travelling. Like, it's too hot or I can't really like do activities in it. I've got to think of like everyday outfits. So it's really annoying and makes it really hard to shop but I think I've got a few things. I've not revamped my whole wardrobe yet but I'm definitely going to have to send some stuff home because I've not got no room for anything now. I've got some truffle parmesan fries. I did order a steak as well but they've sprung the fries out so yeah. Mm. They're so good. I literally love anything to do with truffle. Truffle pasta, truffle pizza, truffle fries. I'll choose it. Right, my steak's here. I don't know what they like. What sauce this is? I wasn't expecting it to come in a sauce, but let me try it. I have no idea what sort of it is. Tastes a bit like curry. I don't know. No. I think it's like Bernays or something. No idea. I would have preferred it about that sort of thing. It's alright. This is Australian ribeye steak. It's really good. I've not had steak very good. So right, I've finished my food now. I was still going on my last couple of trips, but I need to go and get a suitcase because I'm ditching the backpack. It's too heavy. And the only time I've ever needed like a backpack rather than a suitcase is like on a moped or something like that. But there's ways around it so my backpack's too heavy for my back and I can't fit nothing in it so I'm gonna go and buy a suitcase and ditch the backpack. <laughs> it's a sad day but gotta do it. Right it's the next day now I actually fell asleep on the green last night but I'm gonna do you a little try on haul of everything I bought yesterday. I don't know why I always like don't finish the vlog on the day I always fall asleep when I get in to my lazy bitch but I went to Pull and Bear I don't know what this brand is and I don't know what this brand is either Boy Show I don't know if anyone's heard of that and yeah let me just try everything on for you and show you what I bought and how much it was etc I got this shorts and top from Pull and Bear they're like jogging material and this is like giving me Zara best but I got this hat as well not a hat person at all I keep seeing all like, the Aussie girls wearing their hats and they look so cute, so I thought I'd get one. But I don't know if it suits me. It doesn't at all. I look like an absolute idiot. But <laughs> maybe, maybe if my hair is down, it'll look better. But this is outfit number one. I'm going to tell you the prices of everything. Outfit number one. Do I suit the hat or not? If I had a ponytail and my hair down, maybe yes. But it's giving me like Adam Sandler. <laughs> okay, next up, I absolutely love this one. 
This is like short skirt, like they'll be in a sport sort of thing. And a matching bralette, which I absolutely love. This is so cute, it's giving me like yoga, Pilates vibes. Um, this was, together, 1,230,000, which is about 60 pound. <laughs> this set was about 60 pound. It's from this brand, I've not heard of it before. Boisho, apparently it's like a Spanish brand. I've never heard of it, but I absolutely love their stuff. I got a few other bits from them as well. Let me show you what else I got. But how cute is this? I love. Then I got this dress, which I absolutely love. I love this colour so much. Lemon. How cute is that? This was from like a little market store thing. So cute. I love this colour, it's like all patterny, buttons down the middle and then a long lemon maxi skirt, absolutely love. This cost me £25. It's beautiful. I love it. I think this is one of my favourites. This is from that same Boy Show brand. I absolutely love this. Okay, we can get sunglasses, handbag. I love it. This is like a swimsuit. And then these are just like beachy trousers. This is beautiful. Pockets as well. Uh, let me find a receipt for this one because I can't remember how much it was. This is from that same Oisho brand. And so this was 2,200,000. 1,100,000 for the top, 1,100,000 for the bottom, which is about. That's about £110. I didn't realise it was that much. The thing is with the, like the the different currency, I don't know how much I'm sending, but I think it's worth that. I absolutely love it. Unreal quality. Yeah. Hopefully I don't lose it. Right, then I got some gym wear. This little navy gym set. Cost me £30. And I got this little shirt from Phil and Bear, which was... £25. I mean, and I thought it'd look really cute with this little gym set. I can put it on. Yeah, that's quite cute. And maybe even the hat. Let me get a hat. Okay, let's try with the hat. I don't know who I've been playing. Okay. Oh, who am I? Who do I think I am? I don't know about the hat. But the gym set and shirt is cute. Even the gym set on its own. Yeah. Then I've got this in white as well. Let me try the white on. And then this is the gym set in white. I can't tell if it's see through or not yet, but if it is, I'll have to blur it out. But this will also look cute for the shirt too. Oh love, that's cute. Hopefully they're not see through. <laughs> I mean, I compare it with the hat, but I just feel so stupid in this hat. Probably looks cute, just not on me. This was £30 as well. I also got these shorts, pink shorts, and these little rings from H&M. I thought that was really cute if I can find like a cute top, colourful top to go with it. So yeah. But yeah, that's everything I bought. I'm going to send all my old stuff home now. <laughs> and uh, hopefully it gets there. And I've also changed my backpack to a suitcase because it's just ridiculous lugging that all around. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed, bye.